All right, guys, we're here back at Steve POV's man cave and sick garage here. We got Aaron hooking it up as well. Ladies and gentlemen, we got a pretty, pretty momentous vlog here. Of course, we're checking out the Hako Skyline Road over here. And of course, Steve's insane lowered Liberty Walk 45A with the FI exhaust with the sick wrap. And of course, oh man, we got the 240 in the back. And of course, it's man cave, but we're headed to his buddy's shop who's basically working on my Mercedes S600 that has just arrived a couple days ago. They're doing a thorough maintenance, thorough check through or check up of the entire car. But we're gonna be taking the Hako Skyline and another car to pick up the Bose Zoka car at his shop. So stay tuned guys. There you go. For the time being, we're gonna hop in this thing Take it to Gino's shop, which is around 10 minutes around the corner. Pick up the Bose Zoka car slash Kaido Racer. We're gonna take the car right back over here, and Steve's gonna show us all the nooks and crannies, all the little gadgets and the gadgets and the ins and outs of that particular car. We're gonna try putting on the splitter and the Takiyare, the uh, exhaust extenders, for the very first time here in America. So that being said, ladies and gentlemen, let's hop in here. Oh boy. Oh, by the way, guys, so Steve POV, they're working on a Project DIY Mazda RX-7 project car. Everything's just splayed out here, so make sure to check out their series. That's pretty cool. Thank you so much for uh, helping me out today, dude. Of course, dude. man. That's gonna be sick. I think, Joy, I'm so excited to see your car in person. I can't wait. Oh, yeah. First time, huh? First time, dude. Well, here. pictures, of course, but now to see it so, in the flesh here in America. Yes, yeah, sir. A couple of teaser photos where he's taking out his Raptor. How many miles does that Raptor have, Steve? 200,000. <laughs> 200,000 miles. The that's best Raptor in, around, man, with 200,000 miles on it. So we're gonna have Steve over here, connoisseur of anything JDM, DIY builds and supercars, to show me around my old car, because I haven't even seen it in its final form. He's gonna show me all the nooks and crannies and all the uh, ins and outs, so stay I'm, tuned, guys. I'm gonna do my best. Oh yeah, appreciate it. All right, so quick question, Steve. I'm wearing sandals pretty much 24-7, as you can see. <laughs> Should I be wearing sneakers when I'm doing, you no, know, when I ride a manual car, or drive a manual car? Is it more, is it preferable, or I mean, what do you think? Should I go barefoot, maybe? I, I'm not a flip-flop guy, Gordon, okay. I gotta tell you, man. So your your style okay. of footwear is okay. not something I would, I would normally have on my feet. Gotcha. So, but and just in thinking logically through it, right. I'd have to say that you're gonna be better off barefoot than with those flip flops. Oh, okay. No. Yeah. Absolutely. Sneakers would probably be the recommended way to go, but uh, <laughs> flip flops? Yeah, that's not gonna work, man. I'll have to try it sometime, actually tell you how good it is. I've never, I've never been there, never done it. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, we got the Hako here. We're in front of German auto specialists who have been kind enough to let me park the Bosa car for a little bit. We got Steve's Raptor here, and we got the Mercedes S600. We got Aaron, we got Steve, we got the kid. We got the whole crew over here. We got to pick up these uh, front splitters. We're going to throw them in the... Good thing we brought the Raptor. I know, right? <laughs> Seriously, man. Good <laughs> Lord. We're going to put them in here. That's. I think that's the shorter one? I don't even know, dude. I don't, I, I don't even know. Big. Get it out. All right, so we got the frame here. Look at this thing. Oh, man. Okay, yeah, that's the bigger one. Sorry, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Good thing we brought the Raptor. No, absolutely. We got Steve POV here, man, with the keys because I am a dummy and I can't even drive right-hand drive manual, yet I have one of these cars here. I am honored to drive your car, Corey. Appreciate it. I love it. <laughs> I can't wait to get the wheel. Here we go. Let's get a little cold start up and then we're gonna head back to his house here. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! Still have one more. Nice. All right, we'll see you back at the house. All right, man. All right, we're gonna be hopping in the Raptor because we just realized, <laughs> we just realized that the Takiyari, the exhaust extenders on the car are taking up the passenger seat, so we're gonna hop in. Ooh, -wee. this is the better Raptor, right? This is the only Raptor. So what do you think about the new V6 Raptors? <laughs> <laughs> this is where the zoom really comes into handy, guys. Got the optical zoom, and we're trying. He's trying his damnedest best to not scrape the car. Well done, Steve. We'll let them. Uh... There you go. <laughs> what? Just seeing the 
You like it? You feel right at home. <laughs> It scrapes a little bit. You heard me right here. Oh, yeah. Right there, it kind of got a little, a little high center. It got a couple little spots where it scraped, but it did really good, man. It drives nice. Awesome, man. That's One good performance to hear. issue we do got to deal with, though. Oh. There is, a, there is at about 3,000 or, or greater RPMs, it, it okay. has a tendency starts breaking up, and it doesn't want to uh, go anywhere. So there's uh -oh. definitely either okay. a fuel or sometimes a spark-related uh, issue that is uh, uh, going on. We'll have to look into. Okay. But otherwise, it drives nice. You got... Do you know you have air conditioning in this car, Gordon? I do, apparently, yeah. AC in this car, man. Look at all the stuff you got in here. I don't all know if you're aware, gizmos. man. Uh-oh. This car has got so much cool stuff. Besides the fact that it's got power everything, you got all the right. power windows, power locks, and all that stuff, right? You've got in here all the old school Japanese cool, you know, Zoksha, this Kaido racer style stuff, the steering wheel, right. shift, the shift knob. knob yep. You've got the old school full din Panasonic uh, <laughs> disc, mini disc player. I mean, how not yeah. perfect is that for the for the age and the and the generation of this car? You know, the mats. I mean, these are like standard, definitely typical, real old school style mats. You got the the roll cage. You got the tesuri, the tesuri in the back that you hold. What do they call them? There. How do you call them? Tesuri. tesuri. Oh, tesuri. what does that mean? Tes hand. Uh, again, oh, okay, uh, gotcha. Grip. Yeah, tesuri back yep. there. This car's got something, you got air conditioning, and it blows ice ice cold too, Ice cold? Man. You gotta feel this, dude. Hold on, really. I can't believe this. This ain't like driving a regular old car, man. This thing, actually, feel oh, that yeah. AC, dude. It's and quite the, uh, powerful, hell potent. Yeah. In California, too. <laughs> oh, yeah. The other thing about this car? Yep. It is extremely obnoxious. Yeah, it's pretty loud. <laughs> I love it's it. It's pretty loud. It's so loud. <laughs> dude, this thing is obnoxious loud. It's got a normal horn. <laughs> on the back deck back there oh yeah yeah the, the, that, we got sirens yeah. yeah and we got the old school speakers as well old right school, oh yeah the old school speakers yes that's right this, is, this car is so classic so old school and it's so nice to me dude 139,000 kilometers is like 80,000 miles it's, maybe it's not driven that much yeah. Miles. yeah this car has been kept so nice so well we got a little performance issue but dude it's scored man appreciate so, it man got it's a great great car Steve POV approved Thumbs up. Thumbs up approved. Get, there it is. We better get him a sticker, kid. Yeah, he needs a sticker. <laughs> awesome, man. I really, Pre really love it. Congratulations. Thank you, man. Appreciate so it. So happy you made it here safely in the USA. Yes, sir. These are nice pipes. We don't want to drop them. There you go. <laughs> nice and long. All right. So you grab, grab one, grab that one, the outside one, the one farther away from me. Take that. Okay. Don't let it drop. That's heavy. And Gordon, yeah. if I have to guess, <laughs> what we're gonna do right here? It yep. looks like. He beveled these ends, okay, so that it should fit just straight, straight in there. Straight in there, just <laughs> almost just like. Oh my gosh! Look at that! Wow! Look at fits that! Fits like a glove. Hell yeah, it does. Wow! Wow! That is so cool. We gotta start this thing up and blow my roof off now, huh? Holy crap! This is Jesus. Uh, huh. <laughs> Let's, okay. All righty. He put the J-Fit on this. J oh, nice. for Japanese. Oh. If you know that. <laughs> That's the J-Fit right there. That's smooth. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, man. Let's see. Last J-Fit. Ready? Here we go. Oh, oh, smooth as silk. Look at that. Little twist. And there they are, dude. Holy crap. Now, wow. in, in your profession opinion. Yes. Can I drive with these Takiyari on like a local street at low speeds or is it a little uh... <laughs> In my professional opinion? Yep. Yeah, you're not going to drive too far or too fast with these on Right, the car. okay, yeah. fair I, enough. 
I, I understand. Would say slow roll in the parade, possibly. Gotcha. Anything beyond that, I yeah. Uh, I would save these for the car shows. Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Should we start it up and hear what it sounds like now with these things on? Right, let's do it, dude. Might even be more obnoxious than it was. Oh my yeah. gosh. Holy crap. All right, let me. Yep. All right. I'm gonna have Steve here just turn on the good old. Toyota right. Cresta. I'm gonna see what this sounds like with these four massive pipes. Oh. Oh, got quiet. <laughs> oh, oops. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. I guess it's not really quite <laughs> the projection. It point. just projects it like upwards, yeah. Yeah, across town here, <laughs> across the valley. All right. Okay. Here we go. And then I'm just gonna connect that right there underneath. And we're assuming we're gonna leave this at the long setting. We're using this as a stopper right now. Yes, sir. In here, because Boom. I think. This setting is made. Yep. He made two settings for your long one yep. and your short one. So let's gotcha. let's see how that okay. works now. That looks nice. That looks a little bit. All right, my man, bring her back. Man, it's like a four-man job here. <laughs> well, I'm just I'm, I'm just sitting like an idiot. I'm sitting here like an idiot, just filming. I don't even know what's going on. All right, here we go. And then let me put the camera down. You guys close to position? There it is. Oh, there you go. There she oh. is. A little bit of American elbow grease right there. Whoa, but oh, look wow. at that, my man. Right, let's take a look. Oh, oh, man. Dude. Now we're rolling. Look at this that. Is you brought Japan to the U.S. 100%, dude. He was like, we could, go, we could make it a little longer with the front splitter. I was like, dude, I that's that's as long as it's going to get. That's, that's pretty long. I mean, that's nice. You could go longer. A lot no. of gay dudes. No. Soki and those guys. Some of those guys are probably they go all out the, here. Yep, huh? all the way out there. Yeah. Yeah. That's insane. I see. You need a whole support vehicle for this one vehicle. Oh yeah, we wouldn't be driving the S class with this thing <laughs> exactly. if this ever take if this ever goes uh, out. I'll put so. a trailer on the back of the S class <laughs> for all the stuff you got to haul. Around. Yeah, exactly. Let's We're see not. what you got under the hood. Man. Okay, let's do it. Because I bet you there's some goodies under here that we need to explore. Oh boy. All right, Gordon. I guess we need the long, the long reach to get up <laughs> under here with this car. There we go. Uh, there we go. Ah. I guess what stands out first, you don't have to know much about cars to know that you got some serious air horns in here. <laughs> that would be responsible for that Godfather melody that's, yes, been, sir. that's been blasting, huh? Exactly. One, two, three, four, five, six. This is a six horn musical air horn system. This is the compressor yep. that powers it. These are the hoses that go to it. And these things are loud, dude. They're, it's pretty wow. loud. Yep. Really cool. And also looking at it, you got a nice battery. Look at that small Lanios, uh, small mini battery with a lot of cranking power. That's an expensive little battery. How much do you think that battery goes for? God, man, I bet you in Japan somebody paid three, four hundred bucks for a blue really? like that. Really? Yeah, maybe more. Who knows? But uh, okay. I would say that battery's probably good in Japan three hundred bucks at wow. least. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Somebody spent money on this car. It looks like Absolutely, you got new wires. Yeah. Yep. Looks like you got a new cap. These are new wires. You got looks like a newer cap. Looks like you got a newer uh, alternator. Oh, you got air. Well, we saw the air conditioning. That looks like a newer air conditioning compressor. That's your air conditioning right down compressor there. down there. Yep. This is your alternator right here. You got power steering on this car, Gordon, right Sweet. here. It's your power steering, but I don't have that on my Skyline. <laughs> oh, you'll have to drive my Skyline one day to appreciate to how try. easy it is to drive this car. Jeez. And it looks like this is a really clean. Look at how clean the firewall is on this car. This car looks like it was an original gray car before it went that color. This yep. is probably the original color to the car. Gotcha. And you can see it all through here. And uh, look, Gordon, by the way, you got... Uh, uh, stiff. <laughs> really stiff. Stiff is, uh, is an understatement. Yeah, this, this car is stiff. Um, oh, boy. But man, look at how clean it is. This car, you know what you can see about this car? What's it that? It's been well kept, yep. well cared for. Pretty low uh, mileage, too. Low mileage on it, too, for overall for its year. I mean, it's been driven by Japan, Japan standards. This car has been driven, but... It's been well kept, man. It's very, very Look, clean, Gordon. Looks like it, man. Nice stuff, man. Thanks. Really, really nice score. Well, awesome. Thanks, thanks Happy for, for you. Appreciate it, man. Thanks for showing me around, dude. Absolutely. Oh, we're just disassembling the car. We're gonna put the Takiari back in the interior here on the passenger seat. There we go. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh jeez. All right. All right. Should we pull the front lip off too? Yep. Let's do that. Tucker, oh, where, where are we putting that thing? As you're pulling back. Oh, there okay. Well, that's pretty easy. Then. Yep. 
and whoops, we pulled the whole we pulled the whole frame off. Oh. <laughs> yep. That's actually pretty cool. We leave it hooked on like this, then Gordon, we go on one shot like this now. Yeah, like exactly. Oh, that's perfect. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Yeah. That works. Sweet. You know what my favorite part of this piece is? What's that? It's this. What do you think that they use that <laughs> aluminum insert piece from? Uh, is that some? Is that some gri grill? Some? I don't know. What do you think? Some kind of kitchen appliance. <laughs> it looks like something a, of. It looks like a. What do they I, call the? Uh, a grating, a grater, grater like cheese grater. A cheese grater that makes that different a, shaped. Yeah, like spaghetti. Are you actually? He probably did, dude. Play-Doh. Like, we have stuff that we can play games with this. Dude. Oh my gosh! <laughs> All right. All right. I am actually at a loss of words, guys. We're just saying this particular car is quite the handful, and we can't wait to showcase this car at like the future JDM Classic Show. What's that show up? Japanese Classic Car Show. There it is. Long Beach. There it is. So hopefully this, I mean, it'll be ready by then. But we want to take it to maybe Sunset GT. What do you think? Absolutely. <laughs> Or just, Absolutely. or any sort of Sunday uh, cars and coffee. So anyways, make sure to check out Steve POV's channel. There's gonna be a link in the description below on the upper right hand corner, all that fun stuff. He's This is your car now, it's your <laughs> style. I love it, it's traditional, it's cool. Whatever you wanna call it guys, it's all, right. it's all good. There this you car go. speaks for itself in my opinion. Absolutely, yeah. This thing is really, really long. Good Lord. <laughs> taking off the uh, Takiyari and the front splitter. But anyways, guys. Give this guy, give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to Steve's POV channel. We'll see you next video, guys.